Morning. Thanks, mate. Hey, good morning, everyone. Good morning, everybody. What's happening? What's going on? Um, I am obviously, I don't actually know where I am. I think I'm in Greenford somewhere. But basically, um, I've come here to a recycling centre to catch up with the guys that were going on that road trip. Do you remember back in um, a couple of weeks ago when I went to the Goodwood Festival of Speed? Um, we met Aidan and Kieran and Dan and they were going to go off on their road trip. Anyway, they're coming near the end of their road trip now and um, so I'm going to see what they've been up to. And also I think we're going to visit like a, an upcycling centre where they're kind of here, I think they sort all the recycling and then where we're going to go is where they turn it into useful stuff. Disgusting. So it looks like on their last, I think it's their last challenge, the guys have um, loaded their car up with rubbish and they're going to take it to the recycling centre. Right, I'm here with Kieran, how you doing man? Yo, what up, what up, what up? How's your road trip been? Wow, it's been emotional. I'm yeah. like, I'm distraught, I gotta go rehab. You know what I'm saying, man? It's been a good look. No, man, and you're very much into your fashion, aren't you? So, wow. Have I you mean, been ruining your clothes? Wow, you to be honest, I mean, look, I mean, look at this. Look at my truck, look, get, get the evidence, look at this. Yeah. These are meant to be cream, these are turning yeah. green. That ain't a good look for me. No, it's not good, though. Cool. Yeah, look good. Yeah, you still look fresh, bro. <laughs> <You still> look <laughs> thank fresh. you, thank you. We're gonna go for lunch and let that get more stinky and uh, then we'll catch up with the others. The others two have gone to wash their hands or yeah. something. Yeah, they've gone to wash their hands because they stink. <laughs> <laughs> right, we're going to meet up with the road trip guys in a bit. Um, but for now, we're going to go and check out the behind the scenes of the editing. On the road trip, obviously, they've been making videos as they go along and these two guys Hello. have been editing it. Hello. <laughs> Look at their on-the-road editing suite. How awesome is this? In a van. I'm super jealous. Imagine this could be what vlogging's like one day. We'll have drivers. Me and Louis will be sitting here editing our vlogs as we go along. So cool. Lunchtime. <laughs> We're having a little break, little lunch break, and it's given me a good opportunity to catch up with Aiden. How you doing, man? Dan, you're right. Kieran, we've already spoken. Looking cool, man. <laughs> um, how have you guys been on your road trip? Really good, thanks. Yeah. Yeah, we worked hard. Played hard. We have worked hard. Worked hard. Played hard. hard. <laughs> Kieran, what's been like the best highlight for you? Most enjoyable. The yodeling. <laughs> yodeling. <laughs> It was, a, it, was, it was an experience um, from the heart. I mean, I felt, I felt cool. We were in the mountains and I was singing and, you know, I felt a lot of emotions. Did you feel at home? No, not because it was cold, but I felt at home. <laughs> Which um, videos are they on? Uh, it, it's on the. Welcome to France. Welcome to France. Welcome to France. Okay. And um, singing, in singing, yeah. in singing, singing in the Alps. Singing in the Singing in the Alps. What was your least pleasurable experience, Aiden? <laughs> The, um, the French trip in Paris, yeah. we had to collect a whole load of takeaways. Okay. We put them in a car, travel for hours with these takeaways. Yeah. So we were collecting takeaway food from different places, right? Yeah. And then we had to travel down to the docks and then hand it out to all these people. And me and Dan were in the back. You had to swap, didn't you? We had to swap. Because so it was nearly vomiting. That's it's disgusting. It was it's far. Was it's it worse? Don't eat takeaways. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Lesson learned. Was it worse than the mud? Oh, mud was fun. The mud was great. The mud yeah. was great. It was the clothes afterwards yeah. and stuff, but playing in the mud was yeah. oh, oh, playing in the mud was awesome. Yeah. The road trip is nearly over. Yeah. Are you going to miss each other? Yeah. Are you like. Not much. Are you, were you guys friends before this road trip? Hell, no. Hell no. No. <laughs> <laughs> I 
I mean, I'll, I'd love to stay in contact with you too. Yeah. And then not just the right here in my heart. Oh. Yeah. Three weeks in a car will do that to you. Yeah. 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 I mean, we've shared something really oh, special. Oh, yeah, haven't we? Yeah. And, it's, and it's not like we can have a break and just go away from the car. We've been together the whole time. Yeah. Morning to late at night. Every yeah. Every day. So basically, to win a challenge, <laughs> you guys have had people in the car and they've yeah. not been complaining about the smell in the car. Yeah. Yeah, they've, after. The, they haven't smelled what we've had in the car. So yeah. like, and the first one was the smelly farm, so we had chickens, uh, pig, yeah. and two sheep in there. Oh, that yeah. was crazy. <laughs> and the judge didn't smell it. But hopefully, nice. after after today's challenge, when, when the judge sits in the car, they won't be able to smell that. that yeah. Smell. So you'll get a treat instead we'll of another. Treat. We've yeah. only had treats yeah. so far. So yeah, that's good. Treats, yeah. If you guys want to see what these they've been up to, um, I'm going to link their YouTube channel, the Fabrice Road Trip YouTube channel, on Dan's face. Right now, so click Ow. on his face. Ow. Click, click. This guy, see you later. Ow. Thanks, mate. Bye. 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 Have a little. I can smell it from here already. I can smell it from here. It's disgusting, Dan. How do you deal with this on a daily basis? Yeah. Let me get in there. That is gross. I can't handle that. You know when a rubbish collection truck goes past you and you're like, oh, it's that smell in your car right now. Here's the setup for filming the car, I'm guessing. Hello. Hello. <laughs> nice. These guys aren't messing around. Right now we're heading to an upcycling plant where they make stuff out of recycled materials, I guess. So I'm at TerraCycle and this is Chris. How are you doing, man? I run a company here in Europe where in TerraCycle we focus on taking uh, materials that would otherwise be non-recycled. So everything okay. doesn't go into your uh, recycling bin outside yeah. the house or in the council recycling yeah. point. And we, um, we either upcycle it at the jacket I'm wearing yeah. or we recycle it. So what's the, like the... That was very rude. I'm trying to vlog over here. I don't know the difference between recycling and upcycling. What's the difference? Upcycling is where you take and you don't yeah. destroy that material. This is old carrier bags. Okay. They've simply been fused together, but you can still see it's yeah, yeah. Recycling, you actually destroy the material. And then turn it into something actually else. recycled something. Uh, you, the branding is no longer recognized. Okay, okay. I actually have some examples around the corner. Yeah, take so me, take me, take me. This is super interesting. I didn't even know that you could sort of upcycle things without completely destroying them. This backpack. No way. This backpack used to be billboards. Advertising billboard. No so now, way. The cool thing is, it's a super durable backpack. Because yeah, that's actually, really durable. So that's probably more durable than your regular backpack. Yeah. yeah that's <laughs> bold. <laughs> so yeah, not necessarily saying hardware, but yeah. uh, plenty of people. It like suits it. you really well, Chris. So I think <laughs> that that's your one right there. That's awesome. So these are like not destroyed, but just Absolutely. just turned into. They do some of this kind of stuff. Like I've seen these guys do this um, in South Africa. But, and um, you got it. Yeah. Kind of like homeless guys turn coke cans into little things that they can sell and it's kind of the same well, I mean, vibe isn't it really? I, and I don't know which this one is but we work in yeah. certain cases with organizations in Mexico okay uh, we have like women's cooperatives that yeah. are actually helping us produce the products we Brilliant. have operations all over the world so. that's fantastic cool it's good to meet you Chris thanks so much you. You, get, you know what it doesn't smell too bad in told here. you what did I tell you what did I tell you fancy don't smell <laughs> Don't smell. It's you've done well. You've done well. I think we've done a good job. Yeah. Yeah. So these guys are having someone come in now and um, determine whether or not it's stinky. And if it's not stinky, then you get a treat. Yeah. yeah. Which Hopefully. we don't know what it will be. A re reward, we call it. Yeah. yeah. Kieran's confident, as yeah, always. 100%. We're Kieran's test. so confident, he puts his house on the line. All the time, baby. <laughs> it's quite funny. That's a terrible idea. Oh. Got, I gotta go though, guys. Right, so it's nice oh, to see you. Hey, baby's one cool ass dude. <laughs> Thanks, man. Buddy. See you later, bro. Bye. Speak to you later. Okay, okay, yeah, Wait, good luck, yeah? Bye. See you later, dudes. How are you? I'm very well, yeah? Yeah, good, thanks. So, Walton on Thames. Walton on Thames, please, yeah. Cool, thanks very much. Have a good day, yeah? Who's there? Who's there? Hello, buddy. Hello, buddy. Hello, yes, that's nice. Whoa. Wow, pups. Whoa. Hey, Mumsy. Let's put the kettle on. I need a cup of tea. Yep. And you need to stop chewing on my fingers. Mm, yeah. Baby. Hey. How you doing, my pickle? I'm good, how are you? 
not too bad, not too bad. You're That's pixely, cool. you're pixely. All right. Can you see me? I see you, yeah. Cool. How are you? I'm good, how are you, apart from this? What? Oh yeah, you smashed your phone. Why did you do that? Oh, it's mangled. Yeah. You know what else? You didn't take your old iPhone back either. Like I didn't even think twice when I picked it up. I didn't even look to pick it up. I was like, oh, whatever. Trying to have a Skype conversation with Nicole and the internet is so terrible. Not here, in South Africa. That we can't even have a Skype conversation. It's crap. The most amazing adverts come up on my new vlog. Guys, I want you to go to NicoleEddy.com and read her new blog about called Losing Our Identity. It is about getting sucked into social media and not knowing even what to do really with our lives to be a unique individual anymore. So it's very, it's, I think it's Nicole's best blog yet. It's very, very good. Link is in the description. Um, as you can probably tell, I'm all gimped up in my Lycra, so I'm going to go for a cycle ride. Well, tonight's the first time I've felt like I've really improved from my training on a bike. At a good average speed, 52 k's in one hour 40. Feeling really good, I feel like I can push on a little bit now. Oi, Mr. Waggy, what are you saying? What are you saying, Alfie? <coughs> good boy, good boy. Right, my furry little internet friends, I am going to bed and I just wanna give you a quick reminder to go and check out the Febreze road trip gang. They are hilarious and their videos are really, really cool. I had a really cool behind the scenes peek today and there's a lot of cool production that's going into those videos and they're putting them like almost next day out. So go check them out, click on my face if you want to go and check their YouTube channel out. Um, yeah, I am flipping tired after my cycle ride. I've eaten my body weight in quiche and I'm gonna go to bed now. So I'll check you guys tomorrow. Remember to work hard, be nice to people, try not to get lost or killed. Okay, I love you, bye. Guys, look at this little shop I found. I'm gonna give this little guy a go. These are the guys who are gonna replace your penny board. 